Ron Willis is the founder of Willis Supply. It all began in 1967. Willis Supply originally was dedicated to luxury plumbing fixtures. Willis became very successful as a leader and innovator in quality plumbing products. As we've come to appreciate, Ron is never satisfied with being just another company, distributing just another product. Ron was careful to only offer products to the market that were new and exciting. Ron sources innovation all over the world. In the 70s and 80s, the company became very successful. Ron placed an emphasis on developing strong business relationships with high-profile manufacturers throughout Europe, with a major presence in Italy. The offering was always cutting edge. New designs, shapes, colors, products that were very new to the Canadian market. This business model is inherent in our company even today. Ron has always challenged us to think outside of the box and to make a statement in our product offerings. For this reason, Willis Supply has always been and will always be a step ahead of the competition. So Willis continued to grow. More people, more technology. Early in the 80s, Willis Supply started to have some success with a new product called DuPont Corian. Over time, Ron built a very strong relationship with DuPont and predicted the future success of Corian in the marketplace. He made the difficult decision to begin to vacate the luxury plumbing business to allow time to place an emphasis on the Corian product in southern Ontario. Ron's instinct was correct. Over time, Willis proved itself a very successful distributor. In the early 90s, DuPont recognized Willis as a force in the market and granted Willis supply the exclusive rights for Corian to all of Ontario. So again, Willis grew. But we weren't finished yet. Willis Supply continued to prove to DuPont that our strengths were our passion and our people. Ron built the company in preparation of our next great accomplishment. In 1994, Willis was granted the exclusive right to distribute Corian in Western Canada. This was a very exciting time. It was rewarding to be acknowledged as a now significant force in the Corian business. This was a real turning point for Willis Supply. We were national. Our family needed to expand. Our technology needed to improve. We were in a huge territory with a multitude of new trends and buying habits. We needed to prove that we were up to the task. We had strong leadership. We had a will to succeed. So again, Willis grew. In 2001 came our most exciting news. DuPont had come to understand about Willis Supply what we already knew. This little Canadian company out of Burlington, Ontario was not just another company. There was something unique. And for the first time in the history of the DuPont Corian business, Willis Supply, a Canadian company, was awarded the exclusive rights to an American territory. The Willis Supply Company would now be the sole distributor of DuPont Corian in Ontario, Western Canada, Washington, Oregon, and Alaska. This was big. This was a pivotal time at Willis Supply. New faces, new departments, and a brand new head office. Our business was growing at a record pace. Our bond with DuPont was strong. We had a great product and great territory, but that alone could never make Willis Supply succeed. Ron always understood that the core of a successful company was the people. Willis Supply was emerging as a company with a passion and integrity. We knew it as a company. DuPont recognized it with their support. After 13 years of focusing exclusively on Corian, we decided to use the strength of our people and our business relationships to branch out into new products and companies. In 2004, Ron and Mike traveled to China to source reliable building products and establish a presence in the marketplace. Our travel also took us to Italy, where we established a relationship with the ARPA laminate business. We now have exclusive rights to this exciting line of building materials. New business, of course, means new responsibilities. So today, as in the past, Willis will grow. Ron paved the way for this company to reach beyond itself and approach tomorrow as if it had no boundaries, no limits. In 2006, the torch was passed. Ron left to enjoy his retirement and Mike took on the role of sole owner of the company. It was a new era and Mike was ready to lead Willis into the future. As we continue to evolve and grow, we added DuPont Zodiac quartz surfaces back into our product mix. This would mean bigger and better warehouse facilities, including the world-class facility at Lakewood, Washington, plus a greater presence and influence in the market. We also added artisan sinks and faucets to round out our product offering. As the company continued to grow, there became an even greater emphasis on the importance of our culture at Willis. Mike knew that even though we had excellent products and market share, 
those things alone did not make a great company. It was around this time that we began to hear stories about a colorful rubber band ball. The ball represented a new focus on the richness of the culture at Willis, or what became known as the Willis Way. Simply put, the internal core bands were meant to represent the culture at Willis, our DNA, guiding principles, and the acronym known as ROC, Relationships, Opportunity, Character, and Knowledge. The external color bands represent the people who make the company whole. In essence, this rubber band represented the fact that the Willis Way could not work if we did not incorporate the principles of both the inner and outer rubber bands. 2009 was a huge transition year at Willis. Even though the economy was experiencing one of the worst recessions in history, it didn't stop us from looking ahead to a great future. We had the right people and the right products. We were aligned as a company. We knew that our future success would require room to grow. So, with the support of our Willis team, we left our head office on Harvester Road and moved to a new, larger facility on Pioneer Road. This was an enormous undertaking, but it symbolized our commitment to bigger dreams and grander successes as a company. We dedicated a large space in the new building as the Ron Willis Learning Centre. This space would serve as an educational facility for staff and industry to stay current and connected to the market trends. The world economy changed drastically over the last 10 years. Business as we knew it had to evolve with the changing climate. Strategic steps were taken to ensure the lifespan of our company and our people. These changes included ending our presence in China. It also meant a stronger focus on brand marketing and strategy. This would mean additional warehousing and logistics and a clear and focused approach to market. Around this time, the Willis leadership team was formed, with Steve Jones at the helm. The objective of the team was to approach the current economy with nothing less than excellence. Most companies hope to exist within these conditions, but Willis would excel. Again, we had confidence in our products, but our greatest resource, the one that set Willis apart from all the rest, was the people. Yes, our people. The Willis family of employees continued to emerge as our most valuable asset. Although many of our staff is spread out through Canada and the Pacific Northwest of the United States, we have always taken the opportunity to get to know each other. Cedar Grove Lodge in Huntsville, Ontario has served as the hub of our connectivity. Our weekends at Cedar Grove always prove that we can play as hard as we work. There's something about Cedar Grove that builds strength and character in our team. We love our homecoming weekends. 2011 was a milestone. It had been 10 years since Willis expanded into the West and the United States, and we had some cruises to hand out. At Willis, it has always been our honor to reward 10-year employees with a cruise of their choice. In 2011, we rewarded five people with cruises. In total, nine employees have enjoyed a 10-year cruise. We are so proud of this statistic as it speaks to dedicated and deserving people and their loyal service to Willis. Recent years have brought new and ever-changing ways of communicating with each other and our customers. Facebook and social media have created new avenues of connecting and speaking. Willis has stayed on top of these trends with innovative website designs, webinars, and evenings of inspiration. Our focus is to stay ahead of market trends, and we invite the design community and our customers to stay inspired. Whether it's commercial, residential, healthcare, development, design, or one of the many other market segments, Willis remains focused on educating and motivating our customers. In 2012, the Willis family celebrated Mike's 20th anniversary as the visionary voice at Willis. A surprise celebratory gathering took place at which all Willis employees either joined in at head office or participated in a live stream of the festivities. Additionally, as a gift, Mike received a book full of memories. The book detailed personal memories from each and every Willis employee, which recounted special moments that they held with Mike. This would be the first time in the company's history, maybe ever, that Mike was speechless. So, it's been 45 years. As the company has grown and expanded, so has the Willis culture. Willis is a force in our industry. We have a wonderful, rich history that has shaped us. It's imperative that we always remember the people and the contributions that brought us to this point in our company's history. Our future is exciting. Willis remains in capable hands and will continue to exceed all expectations.